Hey everyone, good morning. It's the 5th or the 6th today? Um, Wednesday, whatever that is. Our, uh, our camera's playing up a little bit, but I'm, I'm gonna try and make some videos. Um, it keeps cutting out and, and we've got no idea why. So, uh, yeah, we'll see. So, got my baked goods, got my vitamins, I'm, I'm set for the morning. Um, yeah, gonna continue with some of the hay, uh, see if I can take out a few of those beams, the supporting ones. Um, we'll see. So, first things first, we're gonna go upstairs in the house. There's some, um, there's some decent sort of canvas bags there. Um, so we're going to save some of the hay, take it to the other house. It's really good for the chickens. Um, yeah, and it might just leave me a little bit less here, which would be wonderful. All right, so got a load of bags. Lock this up and get dusty again. The view from up here is really nice in the mornings. Um, yeah, it's beautiful, so peaceful. should be enough. Alright, so uh, it's made a little dent. There. <laughs> Two full bags. Uh, it's already making me a cheek, so I'm going to stop that for now and, and do some real work. So I'm hoping that the light is good enough here that the camera picks it up. But you can see I've moved approximately half of the room to this side. Um, that's where I fell through the floor. And now I'm going to go through and I'm going to start removing these, uh, these little supports in between the beams. Um, I don't think any of them are going to be any use apart from burning, but um, yeah, should be fun, nice and dusty. Alright, so I've done a little bit here, um, camera should be able to pick it up, uh, look at that structure up there, absolutely beautiful, uh, Hudson is going to be a lucky boy with this room, can't wait to get him in it. About 50% done I reckon, and I've got to remove these beams. It's knackering, not gonna lie. Okay, uh, so it's just coming up to 11 o'clock. Gonna head back to the house so, um, so Emily can start work. Um, Wednesday, she normally tries to do, not a half day, but sort of three quarters of a day. So should be able to get back this afternoon. Maybe both of us, who knows? Um, yeah, I'll chime in then. Okay, so come back this afternoon. Uh, book the dog with me. Get her used to it, she loves running around. There she is. Okay. <laughs> yeah, she's really uh, really dumpy at the moment. Pretty sure she's gonna have some pups. Um, yeah. Add to the family.
Okay, so got that half done. Didn't take as long as I thought, but hopefully the light is better in here now because we don't have a roof. So uh, yeah, on to round two. So once I've moved this hay down to this section, I'll remove all of the timbers up here, place them here. I should have two piles of hay and a big pile of timber. So yeah, moving forward, it's great. Naked. Oh, it's uh, I think it's about 14 degrees today, and uh, it's killing me. But yeah, loads of hay, loads of wood, and no ceiling. Apart from one, two, three, four more beams. So, got most of the uh, beams out. Quite troublesome, some of them. And, uh, yeah. Making my way through, my hands are killing me. Um, but I've got four more to do, all of the bits in between, plus a load of hay. Joy. Oh, knackered. Uh, got all the hay down. As you can see, this pile was already here. So we've got these big piles here and some wood. Still got four beams to take out and the pieces in between. So I need my hammer. Guess where that is? I know, what a div. Found her. I only had to move that much. Jeez, I'm sweating. Uh, I'm gonna have a fag break. Uh, get some water for sure, make sure the dog's got some. And uh, yeah, carry on. <laughs> Say hello. <laughs> hello. I've come to the house to see what Daddy's doing. I didn't need the old roll neck new Christmas jumper from Nana and Papa because it is like 19, 20 degrees today. Do you think? <laughs> A year ago, we were driving back from Sofia after having Hudson in the hospital and. Um, snow on the ground and it was the first time he was in the car and I was petrified but we were fine obviously we came back to thick snow and the house and it's heating up but now it's just stunning isn't it can't believe it it's crazy what do you think of this old enamel sink I'm wondering if it's worth doing it up because I love the size uh, eventually for the kitchen I wonder if that's worth restoring I mean, we could always keep it as an outdoor sink, but I quite like that for myself, for my kitchen. Loving the old watering can. I'll probably make that a planter, I'm sure. Look at the old horseshoes. He's loving the freedom. Hello, monkey. Hello. I need this jumper today. <laughs> It's crazy hot. Wee, wee, go on then. Oh my gosh, you just picked me a flower. You picked a mummy a flower. <laughs> oh, thank you, darling. That's beautiful. Thank you. That's so sweet. <laughs> <laughs>
you get it for mummy. You are so sweet, darling. Thank you. It's not food. <laughs> thank you, monkey. Give it back. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you, baby. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, just finished up. I'm gonna call it quits for the day, but uh, yeah, got all of the timbers out and cleared. Well, kind of. Two separate piles here. No beams. It's uh, it's an amazing little space. It really is, it's great. You enjoying the freedom? Are you? Don't let them get the mud out of these clothes. You enjoying the freedom? It's alright mate, you get muddy. He's on a mission. So, that's us done for the day. Uh, say goodbye. Goodbye. Say goodbye, mister. Say we'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>